What's going on everyone? Stress here, 221B Tactical. Today we are talking about the Tradecraft Jacket. It is our newest tactical EDC, everyday carry, everything you need tactical jacket. But one of the best features about this jacket is the feature you cannot see. So today we're gonna go over all the features and show you just how incredible this jacket is. Now, we're gonna start out with the main feature of the jacket, which is the body armor panels. Yes, this jacket right now that I'm wearing has body armor panels inside of it. You may not be able to tell. If you look really close, you might be able to tell. However, in just passing by, no one would ever even know that this jacket is a fully level 3A armor jacket. There are two panels here inside these two front pockets that give you level 3A protection. There's also a 10 by 12 panel on the back. So uh, a lot of people are saying, well, you know, sometimes in certain positions, certain light, you could see the armored panels. Well, this is a jacket that is going to give you armored protection. And if you want that in a jacket, of course, you're going to have some sort of printing at some point, depending on your size and depending on how you're wearing the jacket. But for the most part, it is a concealed armor jacket. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how the panels go in uh, on the front and back, and then we're going to go into some of the other features of the jacket that you can't see with the naked eye. Of course, uh, you have a great outer shell here that's going to protect you from all the elements, very basic that you need to protect you from the rain, the snow, and all those things. Great wind blocking outer layer as well. So let's get back to those armor panels that are here. Now we have two separate panels that give you that armor protection. Now these panels are actually custom sized for this jacket. So you're not gonna be able to find these panels anywhere else. This is for the left side of the jacket and this is on the right side of the jacket. So now when you put these panels together, you're gonna see a panel that is uh, a little bit bigger than a 10 by 12 panel. And you have a lot of protection here. Now, a lot of people ask once again about that uh, one inch gap, uh, or maybe actually less than an uh, inch, it's probably about a three quarter inch gap in between the armor panels. Um, are you not going to wear a motorcycle helmet or a bicycle helmet that doesn't protect your face because your face isn't protected. We see a lot of motorcycle helmets that you know start here, cover the sides, cover the back, but they don't have that face protection. And we see that with a lot of bicycle helmets too. So because your face isn't protected and your jaw is not protected, are you gonna just forget wearing the helmet altogether? So what we wanted to do was give you a platform where you can get a solid amount of protection while also having the function of a jacket that opens up. If you have a solid panel inside the jacket, not only is that going to restrict movement, but it's also gonna be much more visible. Whereas if you have the two panel design here, you have that flexibility to move, and when you open the jacket, the jacket can be opened and function as a normal jacket. So um, you're getting a lot of protection here for what you're looking for. This is something that you wanna be mindful of and you don't wanna just dismiss and say, oh, well, you know, uh, you have a little bit of a gap here, so uh, forget it, I don't want any armor at all. Well, this is a heck of a lot more protection than you would typically get with a jacket that has no body armor in it. So the choice is yours. Uh, it was designed specifically for movement and flexibility so you could wear the jacket without feeling like you couldn't put your arms down or couldn't move your arms. Because if you have a jacket like that, well, then you're, you're giving yourself a disservice. You're not gonna be able to move. So that's why we designed the two panel system for this jacket, for those of you asking. Now, the uh, panel in the back of the jacket, of course, is a regular uh, 10 by 12 panel. You could put an eight by 10 panel in there as well, but regular 10 by 12 shooters cut panel that is placed strategically to give you some back coverage as well. Now let's get to some of the features of the jacket. Now, as you see here, these pockets are actually waterproof zippers. So the pockets that you have on the front that your body armor panels go into, not only are they waterproof zippers to protect whatever's in the pocket, including the body armor panels, but they actually function as a pocket 
even if the body armor panel is in there. So you don't lose the utility of that pocket just because the armor is in there. And once again, you have the waterproof. Um, you're gonna see a little pull here and that's the pull on the hood that's hidden within the collar. So we're gonna get to that in a second. So of course you have dual uh, uh, waterproof uh, zippers over here. Now here you have a beautiful, all YKK zippers throughout this whole jacket, all smooth operation, okay? So you wanna get that smooth operation. You don't want those chunky, cheap zippers that are super loud and kind of like, you know, kind of rough as you unzip and zip. Once again, on the sleeves, uh, you have our waterproof zippers here. I'm gonna bring this in close, waterproof zippers to protect what's in the sleeve. And nice big pockets on the sleeve, nice and deep. You can see I almost get my whole hand in there. So it's a, it's a really nice uh, pocket there. You have the Velcro on uh, the ends of the sleeves here too. Now you have waterproof pocket over here. Once again, nice big pocket to store. You could store your phone. Uh, you could store whatever you really need in here. And you'll see here the pot, the, the zipper itself hide away under these little tabs. So you, they actually lower uh, the amount that these zippers might shine, may catch light. Uh, just a little detail. We also have that on the pocket here. Once again, that waterproof zipper here and the, the zipper itself tucks away. On the wrist here, this jacket comes with a pouch that attaches with rare earth magnets. You could use this pouch for your cell phone, uh, ID cards, cash, whatever, and it easily removes with rare earth magnets. You could just take it on and off and you could use that for whatever you want or you could actually just take it off. I had some stuff in the pouch and I left it in the truck. So um, I just have the, the regular sleeve here with the magnets, but the reality is you could just wear the jacket like this and you could use that pouch or not. It's totally up to you. Here on the front pockets, you have rare earth magnets that help close the pocket. And actually I'm gonna see if you could hear this as they close. And you'll see that pocket just kind of sucks closed like that. I'm gonna pull this open and you can see that pocket sucks closed. So that's so if you have something in your pockets and you take your hands out of your pockets and you begin moving, they close automatically and give you a little bit of protection. So if you have something valuable in the pocket, uh, passport, cash, or whatever, it's not so easy for it to fall out. And also, it's not so easy if someone tries to walk by and you know try to pickpocket you, you have that magnet where that has to be broken and you'd actually have to feel that force of someone trying to get into your pocket. So you have the magnetic closures on both front pockets here. Now you have zippers in the back here, waterproof zippers here. for this. You're gonna see this jacket actually comes down a little bit in the back and comes down this way. So that's for if you have to take a seat on something cold or wet, you could actually sit on this lower portion of the jacket and it gives you that protection uh, as well. Also good if you're uh, riding a bicycle, motorcycle, bike, and you have a little bit of lower flat protection on the back there uh, to give you some of that, uh, that protection, like I said, for your, uh, for your backside sitting down, uh, what have you. So one of the other cool features of this is a lot of times when you put on gloves in the winter time, uh, you have that gap where you put on the glove and there's that gap between the glove and the sleeve cuff. And what happens is you have cold air that shoots up in between uh, that area and it goes right up your sleeve and it's freezing, it's cold. So what we have here is this extended uh, neoprene stretch material that comes out that you slip your glove over and then you could secure your glove over this and then pull this up and it actually creates a seal so no air can go up your sleeve. Just a little detail that once again, I found annoying about jackets. You know, I did 13 years on the job as a police officer. Uh, there was different jackets I wore on patrol and off duty. And there were a lot of basic things that I would see that jackets didn't have. And there were little things that were pretty like just annoyances. And I said, how can no one fix this? So I used my experience on the job and off the job as an outdoor enthusiast to say, let me fix these little things. The waterproof pockets, uh, the seal on the wrist cuff, things like that are very, very basic things. So now let's get to something that you can't see, which is the pocket on the front actually have a hidden pocket inside here that gives you access to your waistband. So inside this pocket here, there's a zipper. 
and you could actually just access there's a nice little pull tab here i could maybe show you that pull tab right here and it's a night has a little grip on it so you get a good you get a good purchase on it so when your hands are in your pocket you could just have your hands in your pocket and access here so there's an opening that opens up and it gives you access to this area your waistband so if you are in a situation where maybe you have a con legally concealed weapon on your waistband, you can actually access it without having to lift your jacket up or take this down and open your jacket up. Uh, it's just a feature to get to something on your belt quickly and effectively without letting anyone else know. And the, the good thing is you could do this very calmly and you know, Maybe you're in a situation and you have your hands in your pocket and you don't want anyone to see you uh, going for anything and you you do have a concealed weapon, but you know, you just want to hang out there. And now you want to now get a good grip of your weapon. And once again, you have the access to clear your garment from inside the pocket and draw your weapon. And now you have it without doing the whole big dog and pony show of let me take this all off and access my weapon. So it is a good feature will you ever need to use it i don't know i don't know but it's a feature and it's on both sides right and left no matter how you carry and of course ideal if whatever weapon system you're carrying is in the appendix carry position but the reality is you don't know you hopefully you never have to use it but if you do need to use it you have that ability to now do that now i'm going to actually just you know go ahead and Put this back in i got the asset tactical jeans which have the internal holster going so just another uh little design detail built into this jacket now if you have a blade you can access that blade that's there as well and draw that blade whatever it is you might have there whatever it is you choose to carry maybe it's pepper spray maybe it's some other device that you have for your own personal protection but just a little uh, a little nice touch in the jacket now let's go to the inside of the jacket you have once again waterproof pocket here as well id phone uh, whatever you might might need another waterproof pocket here as well nice lined you have some nice fleece in there and then here you'll see i'm going to bring this jacket up and you'll see that's the inside of the zipper where you can actually access from the outside so i'm going to go in i'm going to open that zipper and then you'll see that i have access to whatever it may be on my waistband that i need to get and then from inside that same pocket you could just grab that zipper zip it up and re-secure it so uh once again nice feature use it for whatever you may need Hopefully you never need to use it for anything. So now let's get to um, the panel on the back because I want to talk about that really quick just so you could see it. Very common uh, uh, placement. Uh, tried to make it so it was a pretty universal placement. And you'll see here that the panel just rests in a pocket here. Take the panel out. There you go. All right, slide that back in very easily. And a little velcro tab up top that's it okay i'm going to take this out for the rest of this demo so you have a real hood inside of here sometimes on these jackets you have a pretty beefy jacket that gives you good protection but then the hood you open up the hood and the hood is this flimsy cheesy crappy kind of uh hood that you probably wouldn't even like uh see on like the cheapest thing you find at walmart no this hood is made of the same material that the jacket is made out of so uh you undo that and now you have this full hood that's deployed and i'm going to actually put the jacket on because i'm going to show you one of the awesome features of the hood once again built in for your protection and your safety so now we put the jacket on we got our got our hood here and now you have the brim on the hood to protect you from the elements. But the best thing about this hood, and of course it, the jacket zips all the way up. The best thing about this hood are the cutouts. I have put a cutout here so you can get your peripheral vision and you don't lose that peripheral vision when the hood is up. The worst thing I hated about uh, jackets, especially winter jackets that had hoods or hoodies, and you saw this in our rendition hoodie and rendition hoodie SL, when you put the hood up, 
I would hate on generic regular hoodies that you had, you lost all this peripheral vision on both sides. So when you're maybe in the city or you're just in any public situation, you always want to have that peripheral vision. You don't want to lose that. So these little sniper cutouts give you the ability to now actually see out the side and you have that peripheral vision. Just so once again, another design detail, another design element for your safety, uh, for someone who is tactically minded to say, okay, well, I wanna have my hood up because it's freezing out and it's cold out and the wind is blowing, but I don't wanna lose that, that peripheral vision. I wanna still have an idea of something or anyone uh, coming up alongside me. So you have that benefit there as well. Now, I'm gonna tuck the hood away really quick and show you how quick it goes away. And I'm gonna show you something about the collar of the jacket. So to put the hood away, uh, very easy, very simple. You just kind of roll it up very simply, put it into the collar of the jacket. And we are going to simply zip this here, zip this here. Once again, waterproof zipper, YKK waterproof zipper on that collar to deploy that hood. And now let's show you one of the benefits of this high collar system. So what we wanted to do was give you a collar that acted as a scarf that would block that wind from getting on the back of your neck. You keep your neck warm, you're gonna stay warm. Well, we extended the collar so you had that protection all the way up to your ears and it even covered your face. So if you have the necessity, if you have the necessity to cover your nose and your mouth, if someone's making you wear a mask or you just want to protect yourself, you have the ability with this jacket to cover your nose and mouth. So the other day, forgot my mask in the truck. I was walking in somewhere and I realized, oh, I forgot my mask. So you know what? I'm just going to zip this all the way up. Covers your nose, covers your mouth, keeps everything contained. I see a lot of masks out there, out there that are like cheesy pieces of essentially Kleenex that people are trying to get away with uh, using a mask. This is nice, heavy, this is nice and thick. So if you are in a bind and you have that uh, necessity, you wanna cover your nose and mouth and cover your face, this acts as a face covering uh, as well for those of you who are, are looking for that. So you have the thermal protection of this jacket, which gives you unbelievable warmth and protection from all the elements, snow, rain, sleet, you name it. But now you also have some of the features of this jacket that give you the ability to not just make it a jacket, but really actually make it a tool, an asset that you can use in your everyday life with all the pockets, all the storage, you, this incredible storage all around here. Um, uh, pockets on the sleeves, pockets in the back, pockets, dual pockets on the inside. You have your magnetic closure pockets here, your access pockets on the inside to access that waistband. You have the sniper cutouts on the hood, the high collar, everything you can think of, everything you can need, nothing you don't, all in one item that is gonna actually be something beneficial for you to wear, not just a jacket that you put it on and it helps keep you warm. Uh, and it helps maybe kind of keep you dry. No, this jacket can literally, with the body armor panels and all the technology and the features built in, it could, in some situations, help keep you alive. And that's the premise of why we designed it. Now, the jacket is available uh, in uh, uh, two options. You can get the jacket by itself, or you can get the jacket with the full uh, body armor kit. So the full body armor kit, meaning the two front panels, and the rear panel. Uh, so the choice is yours, whether you wanna get the jacket by itself and then add the panels later, um, or you wanna get the jacket all together with all the panels. Now, just so you know, the front panels are custom cut for this jacket. So uh, if you wanna get the front panels, uh, these are custom shaped and custom designed panels. So you're not gonna be able to find these anywhere else. They're made custom for us uh, by Legacy Safety and Security. Uh, beautiful, ultra light, super flexible, level 3A uh, armor. So it's gonna stop 9, 40, uh, 45, 44 Magnum. 
So uh, this is something that a lot of people have asked, well, can I, if I have my own armor, can I put it in that jacket? And the answer is no, because these pockets are custom designed to fit this custom panel. Now on the back, the back panel, this is a regular shooter's cut panel. So if you want to be able to use, if you have one, you have a regular 10 by 12 uh, panel and you want to use that, you can, you technically can. This is a beautiful uh, ultralight, uh, ultra soft uh, level 3A panel made specifically to go in a jacket that has a little bit more flexibility. But if you do have your own, you do have the option of using your own on the back, but definitely not on the front because you need those custom panels. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I know it was a lot, uh, but there's a lot of features on this jacket. It's not just your normal everyday jacket. So um, I wanted to do a very in-depth uh, overview review of the jacket for all of the, those you, all of you who have uh, those questions. Um, we know that this is a big purchase. We know that this is not an inexpensive, uh, you know, $25 purchase. This is a serious purchase. Um, it is a significant jacket. Uh, we tried our best to give you everything that you've asked for based on my experience and based on your experiences. And we hope you love it and enjoy it. If you have any other questions about the Tradecraft jacket, go ahead and email our sales team at sales at 221btactical.com. They're there 24 seven to answer your questions. You can always give us a call uh, where we have uh, our phone lines open 24 seven as well. So you can always give us a call as well. We love to hear from you and uh, hear direct voices because it's a, it's a more personal touch. So go ahead and feel free to give us a buzz and uh, talk to one of our sales rep uh, if you have any other questions about this. A lot of agencies are asking for bulk purchase uh, and uh, sometimes those questions are a little bit more involved so you can give us a call for there. And of course, for all your needs, tactical gear, uh, apparel, check out 221btactical.com. Tons of products there, brand new website for you to check out two-click purchase just to make it nice and fast and easy for you. 221B Tactical, you could shop 24-7 right from the comfort of your phone. Thank you for watching. Remember, always watch their hands, watch your six, and get home safe. We'll see you next time.